Today we are exploring an abandoned house which has been reclaimed by nature. Everything has been left behind. Look at this old record player. Look at the old dress hanging up on the side there. The toothbrushes are still in the holder. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome to another adventure. Today I'm joined with my friend Ben and we have come to explore another house which has been completely left to nature and apparently it has everything left inside it. So let's go and check it out and see what we can find. Okay, so we're just trying to find a way to get to this house. As you can see, it's completely overgrown here and um, any original pathways would have been lost many years ago. I've just spotted, I think there's an old push bike over here. Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's pretty cool. You see how the, the tree is actually grown up through the frame. Just goes to show how long that bike's been there for. I don't know if I can see what make it is. If it's a an old rally or something. Oh, that's quite difficult to get anywhere near it. See what that says. I'll come around here a little bit, I might be able to see it a bit better. It's got little Sturmy Archer gears on it. No, I can't read what that says, which is a bit annoying. It's got an old steering lock, it's quite cool. You can see it's got the old rod brake, so this bike hasn't actually got brake cables, it's got the old rods, which won't work anymore sadly, but it just goes to show how old it is. Okay, let's continue into the house, which I think is this way somewhere. Okay guys, so the first building we come up to, I think, was the old garage. Yes, it was the old garage. Let's have a quick look in here and see if there's anything interesting. Sadly, there's no cars, but there is the remains of a car. What is that? It's the soft top from something. I haven't got a clue what that's from. Maybe an old MX-5 or something? Don't know. It's anything really couldn't it so yeah the if any of you car nutters out there recognize that please just drop it in the comments below let us know what that could have come from yeah. to be fair with a good cleanup it might be savable that 
bit of grease. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it does, doesn't it? Well, I see some car wheels scattered around. Nothing of real interest. But you definitely wouldn't be getting a car in here anytime soon. That's for sure. All right, let's go and see if we can find a way into this house. See what treasures that holds. Okay, so we're getting close to the house now. I've just come across this collection of old fridges and washing machines by the look of it. There's an old cement mixer there as well. It looks as if someone's kind of, well, attempted to clear this place out at some point. And it's just kind of all been left there. There's an old bath over there. Looks like the remains of a little greenhouse just there. But I think we're going to be able to find a way in through here. So let's go and have a look. Okay, so we've made it to the house. I don't think access is going to be a problem today. Wow. God, look at this. Look at that. You can see straight through to the sky. Wild turkey, whiskey. Ooh. Got a Sunday Express magazine there, dated 1995. Got an old tie as well, look. <laughs> God, there's a lot of stuff in here. I don't know where to start. Let's start in there, actually. This looks like it could have been a dining room, possibly. Oh, look at the old high chair. That's quite an old one. We've still got some ornaments all trying to wear on the sides here, look. Interesting design. Carlsberg. Notice how the tiles have been stacked up in here. Maybe somebody was planning to renovate this place at one point, but the tiles they didn't take off are now sadly on the floor in the hallway, smashed to pieces where they've fallen through. A little TV here. Look at that, you've got all your colour adjustments there. All the channel buttons. That's quite an old one. I've got the old phone. A few other bits and pieces. There's paperwork scattered all over the place, so I need to be careful because I don't want to put any personal information. Oh, there's a gearbox here. I wonder what that's from. If there's any of you petrol head guys out there who can recognise that gearbox, what it's from. There's an old sump there as well, I just noticed that. Completely rotten. A small gearbox. There's nothing on the gear knob at all. If any of you guys do recognise that, just drop it in the comments below. Another walk through to the kitchen. Okay, so we're coming into the kitchen now. Oh, we've actually got a little utility room here. We'll have a quick look in here first. Got the old spin dryer there. We've got a Sunday Express magazine here. Look, this is dated 1993. August the 8th. There's a few bits here on the side. We've got an old toolbox. All the tools still in it. Look what that was. Looks like some plants or something. Can't look at the spider webs up here. Ooh. Oh, the spider is actually still there. Sadly, he's no longer with us anymore. Ben's gone through to the kitchen. God, what a mess. A radio there. There's a lot of stuff in here. A lot more than I thought there was going to be, I must be honest. Difficult to walk around in here. And there's stuff everywhere. The old toaster. 
tower toaster. Look, some more impressive spider webs. Look at the funnel on that one, look. Cool, I hope he's not still in there. <laughs> you just cannot see through the windows. But you can just about see through that one there. You can just about see how much land this house has got. It's quite a lot. Got a newspaper there, look. That's dated 1996. Oh. Is that an old asbestos flu? It looks like it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I guess in the boiler. Oh, there's the boiler there, look. <laughs> Oh, blimey, look at this. Look how nature is finding its way back in here. God, look at the state of this toilet. Oh, look, we've still got a towel hanging up. What's that, an air freshener? <laughs> still got some toilet paper and some air freshener hanging up. <laughs> believe how bad this is. And there's the old front door. It's quite a nice door actually. It's like a, an oak frame. Yeah, it's very grand. It is, isn't it? There we go. God, I bet that wasn't cheap to put in. That looks pretty bespoke, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. There's certainly some detail going into that. Uh, key still in the door as well. <laughs> Another record player here. God, you see what I mean about all the tiles where they're falling through? And that's not vandalism, I think that is just water damage, sadly. God, there's actually a couple ready to come down right on top of us. Better move out of the way. <laughs> got in here this looks like a I don't know like a storeroom or something some scales there there's a lot of paperwork in here some books DIY projects they are actually all wet which is a shame I don't want to pull them out so I don't want to rip them Let's see if we can grab that one on the top there. Amateur garden in 1987. Oh, look at these. It's a shame. First year training, ITB engineering. <laughs> Spray on relief. Relax, muscular pain. So we're now coming into a bedroom. Oh, there's quite a few checks on the side there. I won't show you just in case. Yeah, there's actually some names on there, so I won't be able to show you those. We've got a few checks there, one for £120, another one for 67 £138, £7.10p, <laughs> £4.20, God. Yeah, 72 68 Wow, really? Yeah. I'm sure they uh, can't be cash now. No, probably not. <laughs> oh, look at that, is that a Hoover? That's a weird looking one, isn't it? That's the second Hoover um, that I've seen. Oh, wow. Obviously, an uh, elderly lady who used to live here at some point. God, look at this. What's that an old... Oh, is that a slide, actually? I don't know. Guys, do you know what this is? At first, I thought it was a torch, but now it looks as if it was a some kind of a slide projector. I think what it is, you used to put slides in there and then put it onto the wall and it would project the picture. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. If I'm wrong, then please correct me, but 
I'm 99.9% .9 sure that's what that is. Looks like it's even got the holder there still as well. <laughs> All the neck curtains are still hanging up. The curtains here are deteriorated. Just completely rotten away. Oh, oh wow, there's an old dress hanging up on the wall there. Look at these cobwebs in here too. Crikey. All We've got checks. in there more checks. Yeah. Ben's found some more checks in the drawer. Is that an old TV? That's quite cool. That's interesting. What's that over here? Is that some kind of a, a water softener? I don't know what that is. Yeah, I think it is a water softener. I'm not 100% sure. A very very old one if it is oh, I think we've got maybe two more rooms to look in and a small cupboard is there anything in there no nah. yeah, mains of an old bird nest or something Ugh. God. Oh, seen any rats or anything. yeah I am Good actually yeah <laughs> so we've got here ah, we've got the bathroom here oh look at this Oh, that's pretty grim. Looks like dirty washing. Oh, look at this. All the toothbrush is still in the holder. Shaving foam, Vaseline. Eye ointment. Little Tesco shampoo. TCP. That stuff stinks. I hate that. It's really cool that all this stuff is still here. Scales on the floor down there. Sadly, all these tiles have fallen off the wall. And again, I think this is just water damage that's caused this. I don't think it's vandalism at all. And this property has been empty for a very, very long time. You can see the old parquet floor and it's popped up. I didn't even know this was parquet floor until now. It's so well hidden under all the leaves and the mud and everything else on top of it. Ah, so this must have been the master bedroom. Crikey. Oh, just got dripped on then. Oh, I've just noticed some sort of paperwork there. I don't know what that is. Be careful because it's got some personal information on the top of it. Oh, yeah. Um. I'll come back from a distance and it should be all right. It looks like it's a survey. Oh, okay. Economic Forestry Group survey of the property. It's dated 1970. Wow, really? October 1970, yeah. Wow, God. Does it say how much land this property's got at all? Uh, I don't know whether that would be in there or not. Oh, hang on, here we go. Area covered in brown, seven acres. Wow. Area hatched in green, 46 acres. 46? 46 acres, yeah. God, I knew this had a lot of land, but wow. Oh my God. Wow, yeah. Blimey. That's quite impressive. Yeah. There's a map area there. Yeah. Everything, but yeah. Oh my God. That's really That's cool. Yeah. yeah, it really is. We've still got a few clothes in there. Oh, no, maybe not. I think they're... I don't know what they are, actually. Just like trimmings. Was that a sock? That's a sock. That is a sock. I've just touched someone's dirty sock. Hopefully it's clean. Look at these books. Wow. Sunday Express. Oh, you can't see the date on that. 19 something. <laughs> and we've got November 95, look, just there. Wow. 
Oh, very interesting. I think we've got the main room to look in now. We sort of did see a bit of it, but there was an area which I didn't. I think we can go for a door just here on the right. Just squeeze through. Squeeze through <laughs> yeah, we can't open the door at all. God, there we go, we're in. Oh, look at that. The jacket's still hanging up on the wall. Old record player, blimey. His master's voice. Pretty sure I've seen one of these in another property I've been to. Can't think where it was though. Another TV. Another record player just there. The ceiling's falling down on top of them. Then we've got another Hoover here. Quite three. three Hoovers now we've seen. Junior Deluxe. There's all sorts of stuff in here. We've got trays full of big bolts. Another one. Is there? Oh, yeah. Well, that's an interesting wheel. It's got three studs. I wonder what that's from. Citroen. Is it a Citroen? I don't know why, but two CV just popped into my head. So that's another record player. Obviously like playing air records. <laughs> yeah, I saw that one. Yeah. What's this here? 1996. Yeah, 96, that's the most modern year that we found. God, look at that. Some sort of an old, I don't know, like a wheel brace for a truck or something. It's quite heavy duty. God. It's a shame, really. I bet this was quite a nice little house back in its day. That shows how well it was built. Yeah. It's still, still holding as well as it Absolutely. is. Absolutely. Little fireplace there. Little gas fire. Well, I think that is pretty much this little house done, guys. Oh. Right, guys, it is time to make a move. Really hope you've enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. Please go check out the Instagram, which is the Beard Explorer underscore. Also, go and check out the Facebook page. Like always, I'll put all the pictures to Facebook. Ten of the best to Instagram. And we will see you on the next Explore soon.